All right, so every now and then something like this happens to me, and um, I always have a split second of knowing something's wrong because the the page won't load, but I'll see the URL changes to roblox.com slash not approved, and that's a uh, that's a big Gilp moment. What is it this time? Warning! Moderator note: Roblox does not permit sharing personal identifiable information in the form of full name, email, passwords, address, phone number, images of themselves or unauthorized voice recordings of minors um that's a this one's odd uh i don't think i did any of this privacy giving p i i uh. personal identifiable okay i see that's what that is offensive item group id zillion group icon id is a uh, billion what? Uh, so then I went on Roblox and saw this. The Flamingo Fan Club's group logo got content deleted. Um, I changed this thing a lot. I don't even remember what it was. Uh, so I, I actually Googled it and it's, uh, it was this. This... <laughs> This is my personal identifiable information. And so I have changed it. I have, uh, uh, here's the big reveal. It is now a picture of me when I was a minor. So that's kind of a uh, dancing along the, that last rule they had on my band note. Me, when I was that age, I probably wouldn't have, um, this, I probably wouldn't have consented to, you know, being put on this, this group. So Roblox, you're in a sticky situation now. There is, there is a, a big situation happening with with a big Roblox group and you need to act now. You need to report this. This is a personal identifiable. I was really confused about why they deleted my group logo in the first place though, because it's still up right there. This is the same picture as uh, this. Also, if you type in my, uh, you know what, my name. Yeah, idiots are like, making my face into a thing with the, that's that's unauthorized that's unconsented i'm also i'm a minor so this guy should be put on a, a watch list this guy should be put on a watch list because they're selling hats with my face on it i mean it's good that the platform has this rule but it's so unenforced it's just very randomly enforced i they want to prevent people from getting doxxed uh but <laughs> Why only sometimes? I want all these people killed. Who has ever, anyone who's uploaded a picture of me, I want them dead in real life. And I, I really mean that, specifically you. This person needs to be executed and all of his friends too. These are his accomplices. Bella, one zillion. I feel like anything I'm a part of kind of just, uh, it's just bad news everywhere I go. Look, the Flamingo Hater Club, this is just a different organization for a different purpose. I don't know why this one got deleted. Most of every single comment in this is deleted too. Why? Why? Why is everyone content deleted here? Everyone besides the actual scams. Only scams are allowed. This game jam group when uh with Rob Locky got deleted. I lied about the platform getting hacked and they permanently banned and deleted that. What? You can't lie anymore. You can't lie to children. Whatever. This person right here uploaded Jesus Christ himself. He did not consent to this. Probably. Most likely did not get permission to upload that from Jesus. How come the only other person he uploaded is Chris Hansen, the child predator hunter? You know, it's kind of good that Roblox moderation is, uh, you know, under enforced a lot of times because, you know, if, if they over enforce things, the platform would probably very be very boring. But it's definitely a mess when you have uh, mass sc hacking scams going around that are getting people's um, ads for actual viruses that hack your account are being, we're being like one of those advertised thing on the platform for days. Man, you got go you got Garfield smoking big clouds on uh, on UGC. This is awesome. The moderation has always been extremely inconsistent over the years. Uh, a really good example is the original creator of Robile. I'm pretty sure got permanently deleted, but now all these games are just able to exist. Uh, kind of within the past year, they stopped banning them. Here's the one with 8,000 players that baits you into playing it by um you know the test subject is a anime babe that you make and you can pay money like 
and you torture her. That's that's the appeal to this game. And it's kind of like one of those weird sus game vibes. And you can pay money for customization, which I would never do. Uh, all right, let's see what we get. I paid 300 Robux or to turn it into a furry. The original creative robile missed out on actual multi-millions worth of dollars from getting permanently deleted. All the robile re-uploads have definitely made well into the, the millions collectively. Like 50 million visits there, a few there. You know, this one has 10 million. Maybe all the creator had to do, the original creator, uh, was uh, make it so you torture women. Um, I think we all know why this actual creep uh, uploaded this. I'm not gonna go into the details. You can make them uh, thick, which is just, that's just, that's epic, dude. The original Robile wasn't even that bad either. Back in the day, in the early days of Roblox, I feel like it was almost impossible to get, per you had to do something so horrible to get your account permanently deleted if you uh, paid for Builders Club at the time. You could kind of low-key buy your way out of, a, out of a death sentence. It's kind of like America in some way. Dude, or like when they took down my epic 17 plus uh, restricted game. I still don't know why because I included pretty much everything they said you can include. I think it might have been Mr. Chairman Cigarette over here saying you will be addicted to me, but I, I don't get it. Because on the 17 plus category, you could have uh, you, the, it's only bars. what I do? What, you don't think anyone, you don't think someone's gonna have a cigarette duh, at one of these? Was it this? Was it this guy ending it all after losing everything at the casino? Huh? I know it wasn't the dead dog. Dude, I, I got on the 17 plus category. I was on here. My game was getting visits. You have games that simulate actual like beheadings. They make it look like you're actually killing someone because blood and guts will start pouring out of them. All right, we have disabled version or enabled. That's a weird, you phrased that weird. Don't say disabled version. You can go into scenario mode and pretend you're, uh, <laughs> pretend you're shooting up a gas station where where's that gas station you think i'm gonna I'm pay for all this stuff <laughs> and they they scream and choke on their own blood and i can't put a cigarette in my game my game was an anti-cigarette ad too and i could do all this this makes i won't say what this game makes me want to do but it makes me think things look at that look i can trace a homeless man with a minigun Oops, oops, oops. Dude, his teeth. <laughs> his eyes and teeth. Get him out of there. I think I actually get away with a lot. I'm not complaining or anything. You know, I'm just, uh... Oh no, like I said, I'm not complaining or anything because I'm in a pretty uh, privileged position with Roblox. I can kind of do whatever I want to a degree. Like, if you look at the list of rules on Roblox, threats, bullying, and harassment, <laughs> threatening to harm someone in real life, um, I do this. Threatening to hack someone, I always threaten that. Singling out a user for abuse, I do that. That's my whole channel. So I start sweating when I read these rules. But I realize, you know, these are more suggestions than they are rules. You know what I mean? Context does matter, and I do appreciate that they sometimes will consider context. I won't get into the nitty-gritty of it. I just wanted to talk about a funny thing that happened today, and then I went into insane rant mode. But yeah, this is our new flag for now. Uh, it'll, it might get taken down. There's a little experiment. Just trying to see where the line is, where will they commit, where will they not? 